Hello everyone, and welcome to do-it-yourself ideas. Today I'm going to show you how to make a pink crystal heart. It is really, really cool, a perfect idea for Mother's Day to give us a gift, to use as decoration, or to glue it to a card, and it's super, super cool. This heart is made out of sugar crystals, and it's in a really cute pink color. So if you want to learn how to do it, stay with me because I'm going to show you how to do it and what we need now. To do our crystal heart, we're going to need sugar, we're going to need one cup, a spoon, a pipe cleaner, and I have this one in white, and I'm going to paint it with red, that's why I have the red marker, but you guys can just use a, a red pipe cleaner and that would be much easier. We need an old marmalade cup, thread, and a pair of scissors. And of course water, because we're going to melt the sugar in water and we're going to need three parts of sugar and one part of water. So first we're going to grab our pipe cleaner and we're going to draw or make the shape that we want. For example, I want to make a heart, so I'm going to do a small one. I'm going to start by doing that shape. So this is my heart and I'm going to cut the remaining part of the pipe cleaner that we're not going to use. So I'm going to grab the scissors and cut right here. And eventually I'm going to attach these two ends to have the heart. So it's going to look like, oh, not like that, like this. So I'm going to attach it and twist it. there it should stay perfect so this is how our heart is gonna look like or this is at least the shape that we want and I'm gonna perfect it because I just want it to look pretty and now I'm gonna paint it with red marker and as I said before you can choose to use a red pipe cleaner and save this step which I think is easier but we can also paint it with the marker, no big deal. To prepare the sugar, we're going to need 3 cups of sugar and 1 cup of water. And we're going to let the sugar melt. We're going to put it in the heat until it dissolves. So here are our 3 cups of sugar and 1 cup of water. And then, once all the sugar is diluted into the water, we are going to put the mix in our old marmalade cup. We should do that when it is still warm before it starts forming. And now we're going to grab the thread, and I have this white one. And this is going to be useful because we're going to hang the heart from it into the stick and we're gonna put it inside the sugar. We're gonna make a knot at the end and put the wooden stick through the hole. And this is gonna serve as a hanger, so to say. And we're going to put the heart inside. We're going to leave the heart like this for a week to a week and a half. But it's very, very important that, that the heart is not touching the walls of the yard or the bottom. Because if not, it will be very, very hard to take it out. Because the sugar is going to crystallize. And it's easier to take the heart out after the crystals are formed if it's not touching any of the walls or the bottom of the jar. So let's make sure that that doesn't happen. I 
After a while, the color of the heart is fading, so I'm going to use some red food coloring and see if that way the, the sugar can stain the pipe cleaner so our heart turns out red or at least darker pink. And this is my heart after a week that I let soak in the sugar. And everything crystallized, so it's very solid. If we touch it, it's all crystals. So to take it out, I'm gonna use a knife. And this might be tricky and hard, so if you have an, an older sibling who can help you, that would be great. Or you can also call your parents and ask them for help. And this is how our crystal heart turned out. Um, honestly, it was tricky to take it out, but this is how it ended up. It looks super cute, I really like how it looks. And I have this crystal to hold it from. Cute, right? And some parts are thicker than others. If we see the middle, it's very. it looks bigger than the rest. But still, I think it looks very cute. And it is great for decoration. I think that your mom would like it a lot if you do it for her during Mother's Day. You can hang it from the wall, use it as a keychain perhaps. Or maybe you can also glue it to a card and that would give the card a really cool and magic touch. The color of her heart turned out to be pink even though we painted the pipe cleaner red and that I put red food coloring inside the sugar but still I think that the color that resulted is super cute, I like it and this idea is really creative and fascinating and you can use any colors that you want and do any shapes that you want if you have any questions please write it below, I'll be happy to read them thank you for watching Do It Yourself Ideas I hope you liked this video if you would like to watch more, please visit my channel and subscribe for free and be the first one to know when new videos are posted Share this video with your friends and see you next time!